very rich person George Soros has burned through a great many dollars financing rough challenges and uproars in Macedonia, in a move intended to incite civil war and make a military clash with Russia. As strains in Macedonia keep on rising, a few Macedonians have propelled a counter-push to drive Soros out of the nation before he conveys the nation to the edge of demolish and prevails with regards to introducing his globalist motivation. The distress comes from Macedonian President George Ivanov's gigantic constituent annihilation a year ago, which incited restriction parties speaking to the Muslim Albanian minority to frame a coalition asking for it to be represented independently. Infowars.com reports, Ivanov declined to acknowledge the proposed coalition government, guaranteeing they would fill in as mannequins for the legislature in neighboring Albania. Accordingly, Protesters rampaged over the country in what was known as the Vivid Revolution, a challenge like those composed with Western backing in previous Soviet countries, including the Rose Revolution in Georgia, the Orange Revolution in Ukraine, and the Tulip Revolution in Kyrgyzstan. The present government in Macedonia, chose unreservedly only a year back, has been feeling the squeeze by NGOs financed by the US and European governments and also George Soros. The issue absence of energy about Western authorizes on Russia and an underlying consent to take an interest in the Turkish stream gas pipeline venture with Russia, composed staff from the Ron Pauli Institute at the time. Macedonia is profoundly separated ethnically, with ethnic Macedonians making up most of the nation alongside a sizable minority of Albanians and a littler gathering of Turks, both of which are predominantly Muslim. While Albanian is the official second dialect of Macedonia, its use is limited by law. Soros has burned through a great many dollars with an end goal to sort out left inclining fomenter associations, including the Platform for Citizens Oriented Politics, Journalists for Human Rights, and a LGBT support center, to advance his motivation by feeding common agitation. Upwards of 61 remaining wing bunches in Macedonia subsidiary with Soros Open Society Institute, got a huge number of dollars from the U.S. Organization for International Development and the State Department amid Barack Obama's organization, as indicated by an examination by Fox News. While Soros' contribution endangers diving Macedonia into common war, it additionally hazards making an intermediary war amongst Russia and the United States. The United States has approached Ivanov to acknowledge the proposed coalition government, while Russia has flagged bolster for Ivanov's position and blamed the West for intruding in Macedonia's interior issues to assist its own motivation. Republican senators, including Mike Lee of Utah, James Inhofe of Oklahoma, Tom Tillis of North Carolina, David Perdue of Georgia, Ted Cruz of Texas, and Bill Cassidy of Louisiana as of late sent a letter to Secretary of State Rex Tillerson asking him to research assertions the Obama organization channeled citizen cash to finance associations made by Soros.